uh, Jifrin Sunshine. Okay, this is very different. I like the piano in the back, and I like that, I don't know what it is, the snare drum, whatever you want to call it. Alright, let's see if it's a real g friendly sounding song. Alright, here we go, to the melody. Was that the melody? I don't know if this is the chorus or... I don't know. I don't know. So I presume this is the second verse. I'm pretty sure that's a key change into this next portion here. I just don't know exactly what the form is, how this is working out. Like, is this the, is this the chorus? So interesting, obviously, at the soul in the background. Uh, it's kind of near the. This is near the end of the song. I'm sure of it. They're kind of piling everything on. Um, it's interesting how they've done this one. Interesting stuff. Uh, I'll just be honest, not one of my favorites. I was really lost in this one though. Um, exactly where the verses started and ended, where their verses, uh, what exactly was the, the main melody or the main chorus or the bridge. Uh, I was pretty lost in this one. I don't think it's really happened to me in any of these G Friends songs. So that's kind of interesting for me. Uh, so do I like the music itself? Uh, it was very colorful. Uh, I thought the beat was very, very good for the song itself. It definitely matched. I know it's very simple, but you need to have simple beats sometimes for songs, and it's okay. Um, I felt like the transition between voices is very smooth. And unfortunately, I don't know the lyrics, so I'll end up going back through and looking specifically at only the lyrics for all these videos, and then we'll have a much better analysis of that. But as a whole, it was okay. Um, certain things that I think could have been done better uh you know this one one thing that comes to my mind is this wasn't a very g-friend sounding friend or g-friend sounding song uh certain things obviously certain things like the drops like, yeah the drops were in there and a bunch of key changes which is there well very blatant key changes which is what they always do but as a whole this wasn't a very g-friendly sounding song so 
I don't know. You tell me what you think. I know the last time when I said uh, one of their songs, can't remember which one it was, it was a live performance. It was a very uh, girls' generation type song. People got really angry. But tell me what you think on this one. This one doesn't very sound too G-friendly. Uh, in the comments below, if you like my reaction channel, please sub to my channel. If you don't, please sub to my channel. Check out more G-friend on the bottom, more G-friend on the top, and I'll see you in the next video.